Como que se pisa ela assim? Não não dá para não, não dá ele para ele. É, deixa eu ver o que ele faz. Wow. How many carats is this? 1,758, the largest diamond ever recovered in Botswana so far. Let's hold it together. There you go. This is a partnership. <laughs> Gosh, it's lovely being president. <laughs> Before I was president, you nobody, see? nobody, nobody allowed me to do this. Uh, <laughs> so if you talk about the Suelo, it's the largest stone to be recovered in a processing plant. And this mine that you're at right now is the only mine that has recovered two stones in excess of 1,000 carats. Wow. So we're really proud about that in the world. This competition means so much to Lucara because we are showcasing everything this company stands for. It's about this incredible mine where we employ 98% of our workforce from Botswana. It's about this precious commodity that we then go on and sell. But most importantly, it's about that now showcasing the talent that resides here in Botswana. Come in, come in. <laughs> is this the stone of name? Let him hold it. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, wow, you're shaking. <laughs> so you won the competition, right? Yes, I yes. won, I won. I'm the one who gave it a name so well. Botswana was the poorest country before diamonds in Africa, and now it's in the top five. Botswana mine safely, they mine ethically, and the, the diamonds bring a lot back to the communities, it sustains the communities, and the people and the country as well. I'm a product of Botswana, as an example. I've schooled in Botswana, my primary education has been done in, in, in Botswana. Secondary, tertiary, I went to the University of Botswana. So for me, it's, it's in my personal life, huge impact and generally for Botswana it's big because we've seen the roads in Botswana, we've seen the hospitals in Botswana, the schools, everything that we have right now is because of the governance that we've, we've gotten out of the diamonds that have been produced and sold. And that's why we're so keen to ensure that we unlock more value domestically for our people. So ethics is critical. Environmental stewardship is critical. Human rights and workers' rights are critical. And what you actually do with the proceeds of what you get is telling of who you are and what values you hold. This is a partnership between the company, uh, the country, the community. We want to leave a lasting legacy that is positive, uh, that has transformed the lives of, of many people who will go on then to continue to develop opportunities in this country uh, beyond the life of these minds. And I think together with this incredibly passionate team of people that I've had the privilege of working with over many, many years, you know, we can see that. And it's incredibly rewarding.